Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel and another episode of my Concrete Jungle series. So it looks like we got a guy that's taking a little bit of interest in me here. First thing this morning. I think all of his buddies were killed in the landmines over there. Heard a lot of explosions last night. So I got a lot of things done last night. So the workbench is completed. We got a wrench and a hammer now. The hammer we're going to leave here. Uh, let's just leave it a, up here. No, down here for now. The construction materials, wrench we need to take with us today. Um, just so we have it on us, we do need to find an engine today. Got a couple things I want to sell to traders. The rest of the stuff we're going to hang on to. I got some boxes sorted last night. So we got the uh, weapons box at the top, the bottoms, all our equipment. And then over here, uh, we've got all our food and stuff. And I think I made, yes, bacon and eggs and some more coffee last night. We can just throw those in here. So we're doing okay for food. We got three bacon and eggs. I used one last night. Uh, we got lots of stuff here, so we're good. We got lots of drink too. Not worried about that. Lots of first aid. Should be just fine. Now, uh, the forge is melting down brass um, and spitting out bullet casings. We do have a bunch of casings and stuff. I'm not making any ammo as of yet. I think I want to wait and make pipe bombs. Uh, but we do need to get an experience point before we do that. I got the top level of most of this upgraded last night. There's still some stuff stuff that needs to be upgraded. Uh, like I want to get the four corners here. We're short on cobble. We've got like what another 60 left? Yeah, so we got a little bit left. So let's get the four corners done. Just for structure, structural stability in my mind. I still need to get the bottom of this place done. So I'll get this corner. And this one, how much do we have left? 20, we can get a couple of these blocks over here. Like maybe the ones that are like, where a zombie can stand and hit. There we go. So we're just short by a little bit, which we'll pick up today. Okay, so let's go off and do this quest. All right, here we are. Hugh Bank, Hugh, Hunick Street. It's just up over here. We kind of need if the, if the map had the actual street, like once you've discovered the street names, it, uh, actually put them on the map but I know that these signs are like they're not uh, there's not enough of them so that's fine it would be just like a nice little touch though all right which building is this oh we've already done this one well let's, you know, we got two chances at getting this uh, an engine from this car let's just straight up scrap that so we're not carrying it around and then let's uh, Take this guy apart. Leave the knife here, I think. Really just want that battery. Although we gotta finish these quests off. This is just a fetch. Oh, there's the engine. Nice. So let's start this quest. Boom. Grab the cobblestone. Then we'll go back to the garage. And we'll grab the um, the car again to see if we can get a second engine. Because we should be getting the bicycle after a couple quests. But if we can get, like, jump straight to the mini bike, like, I don't know how viable that would be. We'd have to put a couple more points into uh, the intellect tree to get the bike. Uh, I think it's possible. I mean, we'll get at least one level today. Uh, let's just straight up scrap that. All right, let's see if we can get another engine. Unlikely, but you never know. Now nah, it's a battery. That's fine. We got a crap ton of batteries now, too. All right, let's quickly do this. So it is upstairs, really close here. We're going to pull this off real fast. And then... Uh, let's go this way. Let's just do this. We're going to pull this off really fast, go back, get another quest, because like, I think it's just two more that we need to do, this one and one more, before we can get the bicycle. Can I slip in there? I can't. I hope it's not too far in.
Okay, so we got you there. And then these are bookshelves which I can't access, so they must be broken. It's down below. That is so weird. That's not bad. Let's repair that. Don't need the skirt. Uh, final shirt. We'll just take it for now to sell. I'm gonna grab this cobble. I'm not gonna grab the cobble in the hallway. I know there's like three stacks in there, but let's grab that. Now it's like right here. It says 2.3 meters, but I don't think this game understands how far a meter is. Right? Like, I'm 2 meters tall, which means this should be at least 2 blocks down from here. Yeah, it's about right, I guess. Nice. Let's get the hell out of here. Alright, here we are. Let's see what he's got for us. Hopefully it's something good. Could you be in it? I don't. I could be louder if you want me to. Ooh, okay, that's actually nice. You're almost okay in my book. We'll take that. No, we still need to do more. Okay, fetch to south. What's this I one? Trust you, Pharmacy. Yeah, sure. Hey, uh, check your inventory. I think if we just don't care about picking anything up. If we just go there and come straight back, that should be good. Now, he restocked, so let's see what you got here. Silencer mod. Oh, man, we need that really badly. Uh, let's... Oh, man, it's a thousand. Let's take it. Screw it. Totally worth it. Um, dude, we got lucky with this guy. Let's take his gunpowder, too. I, I don't know why I'm buying it now. Well, that's all you're going to buy? I'll let you show I'll buy more later. Down. Okay, let's put you in there, and then we'll modify you. Let's put that in there, because that's probably better, having a little bit more rounds in this thing, just in case. All right, silencer doesn't look too bad in this thing. Let's see how the silencer does. We're going to use this in the POI, and we do have the quest this time. I didn't mistakenly not take it. Gotta clear some of this foliage out of the way. Nothing I hate more than like obstructed lines of sight when you're trying to get to some place where you want to go. Because like all you need is like going at full speed. Especially when you're on foot and you run through there and it's like all of a sudden you're right into a wolf or a bear or something. It's like okay, well that's not good. Although we got that, we've got the leather jacket on now so the run speed is like significantly better and as long as we're not like weighed down there's really not much a zombie can do to catch us at this point like even a feral would have a hard time running us down you know unless they were at nightmare speed then that would be a different story all right let's see where this one is right here underneath that plate and of course this plate has to be 500 hit points I hear them dropping they're outside where are they that one's banging on or maybe she's banging up there <laughs> Oh, there you are. Come on, kiddo, let's go. Ain't got all day. Hobble your ass over here. Get our stamina back. Get that free shot in. Stretch her neck a little bit. Oh, for Christ's sake. There we go. Can't go through a window. All right, let's just break this. Here I am trying to climb through a freaking window. All right, got any food here for me? Oh, not bad, we'll use that. Take that. 
A little bit of medical supplies here. Might as well grab a little bit while we're here. Should make a lot of noise at the same time. Aloe cream. I mean, we're good with medical stuff and we're good with, uh, with, um, honey so we don't, don't have to worry about infection. It's just if we, like, I'd like to get a, pl like, plaster cast or something, but whatever. We don't need it right now. So with the last alpha and the buried supplies, uh, finding the buried supplies in the southwest corner pretty much every time that you dug, um, the fun pimps definitely changed the buried supplies quests. Um, well, there's that brass that we left behind. Uh, the fun pimps changed the buried supplies quest, so now it's like randomly shows up somewhere, so they fixed that, which is perfect. And then what they went ahead and did, and I guess, I don't know whether it's a punishment or what it is, but for all the people that were uh, sort of abusing the southwest corner thing, and I did it a few times too, I'm, I'm guilty of it, I, I totally admit it. Um, but they went ahead and made it so that every single time that the circle, uh, ooh, this water's not going to be very good. Um, every time the circle uh, shrinks, a uh, group of zombies spawn. <laughs> and we were supposed to use this pistol, we never did. Uh, so yeah, so now it's like every time you're searching for a uh, buried supply supplies quest, the more you dig, the more zombies show up. Which kind of makes, I guess, kind of sense, I don't know. But it just makes them, it makes no the uh, buried supplies surprise, quest, unless you surprise. need like... I suppose you want something. Unless you need clay, they're just kind of a waste of time. Here you go. Shots slow your opponents or a helmet light mod. This would sell for more if we found a good helmet to stick it into. But I think we want to try and complete books. So at this point, it's probably better if we go that route. And there's the bicycle. Nice. So we'll take that. Got any special jobs? Trade routes. Trade erect. Sure. Okay. We have Let's go do that today. Come back when it's done. Wasn't expecting to do it today, but um, let's use that book. Let's go home, get the cement mixer um, crafting, and then we'll head off to wreck today. We got lots of time. It's kind of back where we spawned too, which is I'm surprised that we didn't. Uh, oh, we got a pink bike. Um, I'm surprised that uh, it didn't. Um, what the fuck am I wearing? Oh yeah, the Santa hat. I'm like, what the hell is on my head? I forgot I had that Santa hat on. Um, but yeah, we got lots of time, so let's ride out to see what Rex got. Um, there's also, uh, he's got a little secret room at the top of his building that I discovered how to get up to. Uh, it's not that hard, actually. Once you know the, the trick to it, it's not that hard to get up there. I know other YouTubers have done it. I didn't actually watch how they did it. I just kind of figured it out. It's actually not that hard to figure out once, you, once you're up on the roof. Uh, okay, so let's get springs... Uh, mechanical parts, engine, and forged iron, which I think is, should be in here. No. Did we not... Oh, I didn't make any forged iron? Really? Really? Well, that's not surprising. Well, I guess we make the uh, thing when we come back. Forged iron, 25. I thought I made 50 last night. Well, we could still use that. There's there none in here? Ah, uh, you know what it was? I made 30. And... Yeah, that's what happened. That doesn't go in there. I made 30 and then... Um, yeah. Sorry, I'm thinking and like... So I made... I made uh, 30... Um, God, I can't even think now. Put these away first. God, I got a one-track mind. It's like I got to just focus on one thing at a time here. Okay, now I can talk. I made 30 forged iron last night, but used it for the wrench and the hammer. So that was what it was. Yeah. All right, let's go and finish the updates on the outside of the building here first. You, who were you banging on last night? I thought that was a bear. The shadows, I was like, I saw the shadows flickering. I'm like, is that a bear? Everything's going to be a bear now. Okay, put that up. How's this back? I don't, yeah, that's got, I did, did that one already. Got behind there. Got these guys to go. There we go. 
All right, good stuff. Let's get off to Rex now. Ah, uh, where are you, Rex? Over there. We're going to ride through downtown, though. I don't think you guys have got a full appreciation of how good this Alpha is. Um, the downtown cores are pretty amazing, although as much as I want to go down there now and goof around and do stuff, we just don't have the juice to do it. We're going to need lots of guns and lots of ammo. Uh, we're going to need... Um, you can see the crane off in the distance and the towers and stuff. Uh, lots of guns, lots of ammo, good armor, uh, and a lot higher level and ability to mitigate damage pretty pretty easily because there's ferals and cops and all kinds of crazy ass shit downtown. Now where's the main... Is there a main road for downtown? There should be. There usually is a road that takes you right downtown. But this is what I mean about... So we're exiting the commercial district and entering the downtown district and you see this just no road that connects the two like that goes around the outside of the of the, uh, of the uh, plate but this doesn't yeah look like look at this this is so good compared to the last version like it got even statues downtown like look at this place it's like a zombie paradise now imagine this downtown in a uh, wasteland biome. It would be so, it would be such a horrible place to even be. Like it would just be so nasty. And of course since I've got the tiles set to bigger, right, there's a lot of downtown here. So we're going to ride through it all, see what's up there. We've got a bridge over that way that's part of the downtown core. Uh, look at the construction going on down here. Subway. I know there's like underground stuff here too. Um, I think some people have... I haven't specifically watched any episodes of people doing the underground tunnels because I want to be surprised when I go do them. But like, look at this. Like it would be nice to set up a base like... Right in the middle of the like downtown core. Like, on the, like take this park out and make that our base. You know? Just build up, build a base right there. Live in the downtown core. And I think at like later stages of the game, we'll probably do that. Uh, but it's like, like I said, it's pretty intense down here when shit goes down. I pulled off a, uh, uh, a tier one mission. They asked me to go to a remnant downtown uh, in one of my offline playthroughs. And I went to the remnant and then I got jumped by uh, two feral zombies. Because, of course, I've got that additional zombies mod added in. I'm pretty sure that's what added the ferals. Anyway, I got jumped by two feral zombies in the building. I was like level 2 or something, level 3. I had a pipe machine gun. So I wasted them with the pipe machine gun. And then I got, I don't know, maybe six other zombies from outside. Just overwhelmed the building. Like military zombie, a couple of ferals. It was just ridiculous, right? So at low level, this place really isn't that feasible. So now we're, I think... Exiting downtown, are we? And going into industrial. I think this is the industrial district. Ooh, uh, the one thing that this place still has. Oh, there's the airdrop. Okay. Somewhere over here. Because we're going to grab this first before we go. There's a weapons bag up here. Oh, come on. There we go. Oh, let's go. Come on. Zombie here somewhere. He's probably down here. There you are. Free XP. Okay, now just up here. Got ourselves a chair and a weapons bag. It's probably going to be garbage because our game stage isn't very high, but eh, I take that back. That's not bad. Cripple a mod. Be nice to be able to put that on a. Uh, as much as I want this cobblestone, I want the drop and going to see wreck better more. Like there's like a like that goes underneath. It comes up the other side. It's like you could build your base under the bridge if you wanted to. Like there's so much possibilities for this. But I think if I was going to build my base downtown, I would probably drop the settings from uh, from Warrior to uh, Normal. And just go ahead and do it that way. So 
so this is now I think we're getting back to the regular uh, well maybe not I think this is still industrial yeah got a bridge here that goes over a little causeway with some water down there it's so good they did so good I just can't get over how good this is you know so now we're out of, out of the downtown into residential. So the road does kind of go through and out, kind of, in that particular instance, but doesn't connect to anything. All right, let's go get this drop. Right after we check these two out. I should wrench them, but like I said, we don't have a lot of time. Okay, that's not bad. We're going to go ahead and scrap this, though. Actually, we'll hold on to it. So there's the drop. I didn't quite... I overestimated it and it's in a tree no it's not right here watch I bet you any money it gives me a beaker nope uh, book bundle three books that's nice we'll check that out when we get to Rex place so let's get oh god I guess we're not going over this mountain uh, now what Oh, I know what. We're going to go back along the edge of town. Back to the flat zone where we were before. When we first came into the town. And we'll head along that way. Because we're not getting over this mountain. Looks like Rex might be in the desert. Which means we're probably going to overheat real quick. Alright, making a quick stop here. A couple of quick loots. Okay, repair kit, not bad. So the desert is supposed to be the second, I guess, area biome you're supposed to go to in difficulty. The um, the green biome is the easiest one to start off in, and the difficulty ramps up as you begin to go to new biomes. So as you go to the desert, it's a little bit more difficult here. Uh, partially because of the weather, but I think also partially too because the zombie spawns, the loot stage, the game stage is a little higher here. Uh, and then the snow biome, and then the uh, wasteland. Which has been merged with the burnt forest, which I think was a really good move. Although I don't know, I know, I know you can load loader map. <coughs> excuse me. I know you can load older maps, because I accidentally did it and loaded it into an older map. Like an Alpha 19 map. So, I don't know. I guess it still is capable of handling the burnt biome as the burnt biome. Because I loaded in and I, I spawned in in the burnt biome. So, it told me it was the burnt biome, not the uh, wasteland. So, I don't know. Alright, let's go through and loot this guy's stuff. Ooh, that's nice. 12 forged iron. Check his car. Too bad I can't. I'm so, I'm so used to uh, being able to dismantle stuff in the trader. Playing 7 Days to Die. Or, uh, sorry, Darkness Falls. But now that I can't do it, it's kind of frustrating. Okay. Alright, we've got some stuff to sell him anyway. I just got a bus over here. Check his bus out. Now, because of the mod I have installed, I could technically pick these up, but I'm not going to. Kind of a bit of a cheat. Now, you can kind of go up here. Because he's got, like, a little room up here. In order to get to it, the only way I've found to do it is to get up to here and then sprint jump up here. And then sprint jump up here. God, really? I did it like I do it all the time. Why can't I do it now? Am I carrying too much stuff? I can't be. What the heck? I've always been able to do that sprint jump. It could be that I'm carrying too much stuff. I weighed down a little bit. Let's go talk to Rex first, and then we'll come and do it. Because I'm like, I got egg on my face now. All right, let's talk to you. Holy shit! Well, Holy shit! Yeah, office. I know. I'm trying to Doing steal your shit. Um, let's sell Nine. you, sell you, and sell you. Okay, I need you to just like, oh, you can take that too. Just wait oh, here for one second. Talking at goods and that's all you buy? 
Yeah, just give me a second. I got some more stuff to sell you in a second here. I'm convinced that's what it was. Because I just, I was overweight. You gotta be like, weighed, like not weighed down. And then, there we go. That's exactly what it was. There we go. Now I don't feel like an idiot. <laughs> oh, two uh, selling kits. Okay. Some shoes, we can sell them. Some clay. Not sure why he's got clay in his bedroom, but whatever. Okay, we can wear that. And we'll modify you. Take the red die out. Let's put that in something. Uh, let's put it in this. Wow, that looks horrible. Go ahead and use your pears. He's going to come up here tonight. He's going to be like, oh, I'm just going to eat those pears before bedtime. He's like, where the fuck's my pears? Take the flashlight. Don't need that. Go ahead and scrap you. So we don't need the flashlight for anything. So we'll just sell that to him. Now we can check the rest of his store out. Not be overloaded. Murky water. Let's go ahead and use this. Scrap this. What else you got for me, Bubba? Some more cans. Ooh, some pears. Okay, let's go ahead and use these guys. Then we can scrap all this. We might as well scrap the nails too. No point in holding on to those. We'll be selling that in a second. And he's the farmer, so he's supposedly supposed to have like seeds here, but how about I empty your pockets? How about you try and empty my pockets? See how that goes. Sandwich. Here, here's your lunch, Rec. Eat it. Enjoy. Oh, 58 bucks closer to getting our way off this rock. Okay, now, uh, let's go ahead and use both of these. And then we'll scrap this guy. And then we'll modify you and take out the die. We're going to put the die on here. Wow. Blood-soaked idiot. All right, let's just see your inventory. We don't need that. We don't need that. We don't need you. Uh, how much do you sell for? 16? I think you're better for the iron. We don't need this. And that's all. Might as well just scrap that. All right, what do you got? Um, batter up volume three. We have already a magnum enforcer. Ooh, motorcycle handlebars. We've only got four grand, though, so... Let's be careful how we spend that. Muzzle break, if we spend it. Let's see what he's got here. Battery bank. We can make those now, so we don't have to worry about that. Ooh, pump shotgun schematic. Oh, man. I think we want that. We've got like a couple of shotgun parts. You got a full AK. We could do a job for him real quick and buy this AK. I would rather go into shotguns though, but the AK is pretty sweet, man. No gunpowder, huh? That is bizarre. Cobblestone you've got. Rifle parts. No shotgun parts though, eh? Handgun parts. Oof. It really is an iffy uh, thing here. I mean, we go for the. We can do a job for him and do the, get the level three AK. What's the stats on that? Thirty-eight damage. What's the damage on this guy? Forty-two with the mods in though. But the magazine size is bigger on this. The durability is better on this. Yeah, I think it's. Are we gonna be able to make? All right. 1, now that we're done doing business, get out of my store. Look, blockhead, I'd say it's been an honor to work with you. We can always ride back in the nighttime. I think I'm not worried about that. Let's go ride over and do this real quick and see if we can pick up some other stuff on the way. Oh, there's a dog horde. Let's pass by that. Don't want to get involved with those dogs. Okay, this place. Main floor, right over here. So let's... This is metal, isn't it? 
God damn it, we gotta go in. Fine. Don't know why I expected that to be super easy, but whatever. Okay, let's put some stuff in the bike. Uh, what are we not going to find in here, most likely? Uh, we can just go ahead and scrap that. I want to save that for now. Uh, one more thing. Seed. Fine. Make me do it the hard way. I heard you, you fuck. Where are you? Still got a piece of me, though, didn't you? God damn it. Home run. Alright, where did we drop in? Over here. We're going to save that and wrench that at home. Check this out. One whole piece of paper. Well hidden. Well played, zombie. Well played. And I missed. Delaying love taps. Uh, I can't believe I missed that. Alright, what do we got here? Actually, I can believe it. Good like that. Alright, what else we got? Why am I looking through for stuff? Why? Let's just go ahead and use that. Come on. The other thing too is we gotta get experience for today. Get that second level if we can. I got a piece of you. Come on, hurry up and get up and get in here. I want a headshot. Oof, that hurts. That hurts even more, eh? I don't know if you guys can hear my stomach growling. Come on, give me a poncho. I got a problem when I play games is like I can't disassociate myself from them. I kind of get addicted and can't stop. Ooh, we are six dollars closer. Do I don't know what the hell target number that's going to be, but it will be something. See if you can split that arrow. Ah, I missed. Tried to split this arrow. I ended up splitting him in his ha splitting him in half. Okay, scrap that. Definitely take the glue. Got somebody outside that I think can hear us. Okay. I think this guy here is a skater. Nope. He's dead is what he is. Now, I think this one's got a... Uh, I think this place has got a uh, button that opens the door. I hope it does. Apparently not. There we go. Free loot. We should get enough out of this to be able to... Like, I thought it would have it put a thing here to get us out of here. There is our satchel. Let's bust open this shamway crate. A little bit of sham. Let's go ahead and use that. We can scrap these guys, we can scrap the cans. Come on, duster. Flannel shirt. Sells for a bit, so we'll take it. What do we got here? Ooh, that's not bad. Uh, can repair you, that'll sell for a fair bit. Let's break out of here, I guess. I'm sure there's probably a better way out, but this is still kind of frustrating, having to like break out of places, but I kind of get it. Hopefully those plates will drop off the window when I break this. There's the crickets. All this for a freaking level 3 AK. And they didn't break off. 
I can't get out. Well, at least they were easy to break. Grab this. Ooh, mushroom spore. Alright, let's get the hell out of here. No, that's not thunder, that's my stomach. Okay, before we talk to him, let's just dart over here. Is that a dust storm? What was that? Looked like it was a dust storm or something. Ah, he's got a wrench. What's this thing got? Oh, there's a workbench over there too we can grab. Really? Can't get anything good, eh? I think it is a dust storm. That's cool. That's really cool. Garbage, garbage, garbage. Really? I thought the loot stage was supposed to be higher here. Maybe it's more noticeable once you get to, uh... Higher stages of the game, like, that's cool. That's really cool. Should grab those or take those home. Alright, let's talk to Rec. Get ourselves an AK. Stick now that you did what up, dog? I really? You ain't all that damn bad take that. All. Um, can I see your inventory? So that's worth 300 and something. That can go. That can go. You're worth eight. Does 40 block damage. Just does less block damage. So we'll switch these two around. I think we just sell them this one. Because we don't really need it. Uh, we'll keep that. I think we keep the rest of this stuff. Uh, we'll hang on to the polymers. So we're... Oh, uh, we're, we're short. Really? Really? Really, we're still short. How are we going to make it up? What can we get for him? Don't let the door hit you on your uh, What can we get real quick for this guy? Um, I know there's a gun bag in here. But considering it's a trailer. Okay, well, you know what? Worst case scenario. There's a rat in there. Of course there is. clips in a bit. Sure better have something worthwhile in here. Weapons bag. Give me something worthwhile. Fuck. I mean, it's good for me, but nothing we can trade. So I guess we're staying here the night. I was hoping to go home, but can't do that now. What's in here? I mean, if we wrench... Nah, even then. We're not going to make up 300 and just, like, scrap. There's no way. So we're going to have to stay the night, I guess. Let's make a door. Uh, we need a hatch. Which I don't think it'll matter for this place, but we need a door. Uh, where are you here? Where's the wood door? There it is. 
Oh, we don't have any slots left. Let's just scrap this. Oh, shit. I want that one more so than this one. Okay. Like that. Grab this guy. Like that. Cool, that allows us to fight in here if we have to. Let's drop some stuff in the weapon bag. Uh, I guess I could sell the springs. Oh man, really? I mean, that's good. That we can sell on something. That we can sell on something. Yeah, we're not going to get... Uh, wonder if our best bet is just trying to get plastic. Like, we could probably make a fair bit off plastic. It's the most boring as shit thing to do, though. But we could probably make a, a good chunk of, off of just plastic. I mean, I guess we could sell the forged iron, too, off of this. Mechanical parts, electrical parts. That'll get us the AK tomorrow. But then I guess we could stick around and do a few jobs for Wrecked as well. Because it's only day four, right? So, I mean, yeah, we we'll stick around here, I guess, this town. I was hoping to ride back at nighttime and be back at our other town, but whatever. We'll stay here. More garbage over here. God, the resources are just so plentiful. Let's just stay away from that guy for now. Alright, well. Let's get inside. What do we got in here? I'm going to bring it all in. The exception of... That, probably. Because I have a feeling we're going to have to leave a lot behind. Let's just stay quiet. Probably going to have to leave a, like a whole lot behind. So we'll have to determine what we're keeping and what we're getting rid of. <sighs> yeah. Alright, well I'm going to end this episode here guys. I hope you enjoyed it. Tomorrow we'll do some jobs for Wrecked and head back to our other town. Uh, then we can start thinking about what we're going to do for the Horde. Um, we don't really have any consumables, like pipe bombs and molotovs, although I suppose I can make some. Um, I was hoping to get some for Crusty Roads. Maybe Wreck will offer at least 10 pipe bombs or 10 molotovs. If not, we'll be making them back at our place. We'll probably have to spend a half a day hitting up some coal and some nitrate powder nodes to make some gunpowder. And we'll, then we got plenty of pipes and everything to make pipe bombs with, so... We'll figure out what we're doing then. Alright, so I'm going to end the episode here. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, drop a like. If you haven't subscribed, please don't forget to subscribe. You can also drop any comments in the comment section down below. Until next time, we'll see you later.